two point perspective, you're drawing the illusion of a flat object or of a two dimensional object in flat space. So you have these two things that will help you give you that illusion called vanishing points. And vanishing points are if you could see forever and ever and ever and where you finally couldn't see anymore, that would be where your space vanishes. So we have two of those on each corner or on each end. Then we're gonna draw a vertical line in the middle of our drawing. And then from that vertical line, we want our vanishing points to go above it and to go below it, okay? Or that vertical line should go above and below the vanishing point. Then you're going to draw a line back from the bottom of the vanishing point to, or from the bottom of the vertical line to the vanishing point, bottom of the vertical line to the vanishing point. Okay, and I should see nothing in your hands. Eyes are on the screen. So now I'm gonna draw a line back from the top of the vanishing point to the vertical line. Top of the vanishing, or top of the vertical line to the vanishing point. And then I'm gonna draw the edges or the corner, not the corner, the back of the building. And that can be wherever I want. It just has to be a vertical line. Then what I'm gonna do is erase all of this stuff right here, because I don't see that. That's just how it has to line up. <clears throat> and then I'm gonna start to put some uh, detail on my building. So the first thing is gonna be a gutter line. A gutter line is a line that goes around a building that helps the water to shed off of it. So I line those back up with the vanishing point, lined it up with the vanishing point, drew my line. Now I'm gonna put some windows on my building. So I'm gonna draw some marks here, and then from each mark, I'm gonna line it up to the vanishing point, line the mark up to the vanishing point, line the mark up to the vanishing point, now I've got them on that side, now I'll do this side. Mark to the vanishing point. Mark to the vanishing point. Mark to the vanishing point. So now I have my horizontal windows on. Now I'm gonna put my vertical windows on. So vertical windows, when they're really far away, they get, they're smaller. And as the windows get closer, they get bigger. Because as stuff gets closer to us in space, it gets bigger visually. Then what you're gonna do is you gotta put a door on so the people can get into your building. Okay, so there's my door. Got the handles there. Now I wanna make a sidewalk. So a sidewalk starts with a little vertical line. That's where the sidewalk corner is. Then we're going to go to the vanishing point Go to the vanishing point, go to the vanishing point, go to the vanishing point. Now I need some detail on my sidewalk, right? So sidewalks have what on them? Lines. lines, yes, lines. So this is gonna be different. Everything so far, on the left, it's gone to the left vanishing point, on the right, it's gone to the right. Now I'm gonna reverse that so that my sidewalk looks flat. So my left-hand side sidewalk goes to my right-hand side vanishing point. Left to the right. Left to the right. Now my right is gonna go to the left. So right to the left, right to the left, and right to the left. And now I have a sidewalk that people can walk on to get to the building, to get to the door. Now I need a road so that when they drive up in their car, they can get out. And this is easy. It just starts at the vanishing point, comes straight out. Then you gotta have your little line so that the cars know which side to go on. And of course, as the lines get closer, they get bigger. Then little, bigger, bigger, big. Okay, 
So there's my roads. Now I have to put two more buildings on my uh, picture. So I'm going to start with, again, a vertical line like I always do. Then I'm going to connect it to the vanishing point. And this one's really abrupt. It's right by the vanishing point. Okay. Then I want to draw the back of the building and the back of the building and then I have a little line here that has to go over here to this vanishing point now I have like a little alleyway then I want to put the detail on the building so it's not a Kleenex box it's a building okay so giving my viewers a little more information and then I think on this one I'm just gonna have some vertical windows I don't have to have horizontal windows unless I want to. It's my my city. I can do what I want with it. Okay. Now I have to have one more building. Going to the vanishing point. No matter what my brain says, I go to the vanishing point. And that looks like a really weird little triangle, but if I put the back of the building there, put the back of the building, go to the vanishing point for the bottom, and then maybe this one is just gonna have windows that go horizontal. So, I'm gonna line it up, line it up, always lining it up, my brain thinks that it knows it all and it's going to take it where it thinks it should go, but that's not right. It has to go to the vanishing point. Your brain is a bossy little thing and it <clears throat> it's going to say, oh, that's not right. You do it this way. Go to the vanishing point. Oh, I forgot the gutter line, didn't I? It's going to have a lot of water on the top of the roof if I don't put a gutter line on. Okay. Now, if I just put a little line here and over here, <clears throat> that's going to give me sky and ground. And then I could put the sun here. And then I could color, <clears throat> color the sky because the sun's like really bright compared to the sky. And I could do some shading here and this could be the sky. Here's the sky, and then I could do shading. So this is where it's going to be light. This is where it's going to be dark. It's going to be dark. It's going to be dark over here. I could draw some shadow cast out here. Okay, just a little, you know, you can do lots of different things. Here's an example where I colored it a little bit nicer. Okay, you can put zombies in the street, cars, you can do all sorts of stuff with this. You could color it, you could outline it with black. This is the basic how to do it. Any questions? <clears throat>